Hey guys, long time no see. No, I did not quit YouTube. I was just procrastinating. Yeah, uh, that's totally what it was. Anyway, um, this video is going to be a special video for two reasons. One, my return. Two, reaching 30 subscribers. Mostly for my return, though. But this video is going to be dedicated to a few people, you know, Steven, Jeffrey, Brendan, all of you guys who are in the gang. You guys know who you are. Uh, so, this video is about a few things. This actually being one of the most interesting things that I have probably ever done. Uh, me and Steven have been collaborating on this for a long time. Actually, it hasn't been that long, but still, feels like a long time. And... I would like to show it off. Uh, so, if you guys haven't seen Minecraft Story Mode 7, I may have just given it away, but you guys should go check that out before this, because there might be some spoilers, there may be, you know, you know, but this is also, this video is also not going to be edited at all, because my uh, video editor kind of conked out, I don't even know. Anyway, just... Yeah, so as you may have guessed, it is a redstone-operated PAMA version 382-7, created by Casey Jones 382 and Botman 7. Casey Jones 382 is Steven. His YouTube channel will be in the description. It is Trollolol Gaming. And here is our PAMA. Now, this is 90% redstone-operated. Any command blocks that are used in here are for sounds. I can prove it to you guys. So if I were to just uh, grab this and that... Play sound. They're all play sounds. So, it is... It's all of the stuff besides sounds on here is all redstone operated. So, um, I guess I should start him up. We did... This is a special texture pack that me and Steven put together. So, let's start. We have much work ahead of us, but maybe it can even be. Some might call me a computer, a thinking machine. Watch this. Though so there has never been a computer quite like me, my job is to be useful. Using redstone chips, work. I have connected to the right, well, people of the town and help them but. be useful, coordinated, processing information. That's all that's really actually connected right now, uh, and I added the interference located, uh, I added a few faces on here, but, uh, the main difference that you can really see is that I have added this little feature. Yes, the three spires, and of course the redstone heart. How could I forget? Guess what, I did. So... Um, let's see. So, we can start by breaking this one. Now, this one has a very loud and long soundtrack that you may recognize. Please, if you stop, please Rip do not deactivate me. I know I've made some very poor decisions recently, but I can show you so much. I can help you get home to your friends. I can be useful to you. The heart beating is a bit off to the soundtrack, which I kind of need to fix, but that's a pretty easy fix. And then finally... Screen of death. 
specifically because, first of all, these aren't blue. Second of all, because I there's literally no room for this. I can't add anything else back here. Everything has been taken up. I mean, it was a miracle even to get that, uh, like, mad, angry face in there. Because I had to retexture sponge. So if we look, here is sponge. Because the redstone repeaters don't act the way they're supposed to. On the screen, I don't remember where it was. Some point down here. I think I just saw it. Eh, should be, like, directly in the... There it is. Yeah, because the it travels down here, and we don't want that for that specific face, so I had to take that off. Uh, but yeah, there's no room left. This was supposed to work. I don't know why it didn't. Maybe it has to be below you. I'm not exactly sure how that works. But, um, pretty interesting, and... I was I just gonna say? Just gonna say something that I forgot. I completely forgot what I was gonna say. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's right. So I tried to retexture zombies and fix the soundtrack to a different thing, but I kind of failed at the soundtrack. I think I caught some music from the actual video in there at the end of the soundtrack. But I gave it a, uh, a, uh, useful kind of look. Stop looking at me. There we go. Stop it! And then, I can put a... I need to fix that soundtrack. It's kind of annoying. Um, and I should put, I should also make it so there's, like, dialogue mixed in with it, too. This is how it works. Uh, uh, right down here. Uh, Chainmail helmet. I wish you could apply these to mobs. But, no. It only applies to me. And I should have made that better looking, but I'd have to change the entire chainmail suit. So, if I were to be wearing chainmail, it would... See, look, it looks weird now. I messed up the file. I'm gonna have to copy that from, like, some other... Text now to get the... What the heck? My... F that was weird. Wait. Alright, well, something is screwed up. Anyway, uh, I can fix that. Uh, I just need to fix the chainmail looking stuff, and that's it. But, yep, this has been a very interesting video. And uh, he's actually really easy to reset as well. All you need is this to go here. Interference located. Yes, he kind of... I don't know why he says that. And the redstone heart. The texture for this, I put on purple block. And I didn't know that it was going to actually go to the stairs or the slab either. So you have, like, redstone heart look in everything now. You can make a redstone heart house out of this. It's really interesting. Like, look, it's just... How? I didn't even know it was going to do that. It's, it was completely unexpected. Also, it was so hard to get this texture in the game, too, because I had to actually copy it out of the... I had to use GIMP, which Steven had suggested to me last time we met, and uh, I had to actually, like, pull it out of the video, and then I had to adjust the brightness and everything. It was really annoying. Okay, this is also really annoying, and I will fix that so I can cut the music out. Use Audacity or something for that. But it's a very complex machine. And I hope you guys like the video and subscribe for more. Also, P.S. There's going to be a lot more complex contraptions just like this in the future because I finally think I've reached the level of, like, intriguingness. I don't know how you would actually say that. I don't know the word. I, the word is just not in my mind right now. Anyway, but... Yeah, there are going to be much more exciting projects coming out of me now that I've kind of reached a higher level. So, yeah. Leave a like and subscribe. Batman 7 is out. Peace.